Hello everyone, so today I have a quick tutorial for you guys. This is a tutorial for Ethos Smart Piston, which um, if you've seen some of his latest videos, he uses one of these. So essentially what this is, is a piston that pushes back once a block is pushed up against it. So he uses this for a nether wart farm, so I thought I would uh, demonstrate with this soul send. So essentially, this piston pushes out, and that one pushes back, always. And this and this button has nothing to do with activating that, other than the, the block over there. So, first, I'll quickly show you guys how this works, and then I'll, I'll just build a demonstration one. I mean, it's pretty easy to recreate, but I thought I'd just do that real quickly. So, essentially, when that piston pushes over here, uh, you get... You know, that's probably not a good idea. When you place a piss when you place a block here, or when this piston pushes this block over, it completes. Well, it the the power runs through the block that's here, that is in this spot that runs through this uh, repeater, and then through this one here back to this piston, which pushes it back. So essentially, it's just completing a circuit every time that closes. Um, so basically, what you need to do, it's pretty simple you put a piston down and then some way to power it you can just throw a pressure plate down whatever you want um, then you can use whatever block type you want we can do a little bit of dirt here if you want um, and then you're gonna break a block down here I'll quickly just make it so that we can we have ground there and then it's just a red t stone torch in the bottom piston on that side and then we need one redstone repeater um, at three or at four, so full uh, the the longest distance I guess on it, and then another one longest distance, and then your final one just needs to be um, at one tick, so four, four, and one. You close this up, and it's as easy as that. So you press here, it goes down, comes back right, comes right back. So that is how to make a smart piston. Uh, there are a lot of uses for this. A lot of farming applications you can try it with different types of I know you could probably use this for like a moving or a, the, a shifting floor to get mobs to fall through I'm not sure if that glitch still works though but that would be this would be a way to perform that same action and I hope you guys enjoy this quick little tutorial more to come thanks for watching